Hi, in this video, I would like to demonstrate how you can send log data entries to the BMC Helix Log Analytics via REST API. To accomplish this requirement, you can develop a script using any recommended programming language. For this video, I have used Python language with 3.x version. You can go through the mentioned documents provided hyperlinks into the knowledge article. Let's begin with authentication. Get logged into the Helix portal. Navigate under the user access and the users. Go to the API users. At the API user section, you can create the API user using the option called add API user. After creation of the user, you can get the access key and the secret key. We require these keys to update the GWT token. If the user is already created, then you will get it from the user options from the action drop down menu. Here is you can see that the access key and the secret key is generated. To show a practical example of how you can send log entries to the BMC Helix log analytics, the file I wanted to scan for a pattern matching is located in a conf directory and the script it is located into the bin directory. The complete script you will get it from the knowledge article. This is the script here imported the required modules, defined variables, for example conf bin url underscore token which contains the url, payload underscore token which contains the access key and the secret key, header underscore token which is used for the REST API call. There are three functions created, get underscore token, read log file and send log analytics. The get underscore token function will get the token using the post method along with the defined variables and generate the JSON web token. The script will refresh the JWT automatically as it expired every 15 minutes. The read log file function will generate the valid JSON after reading the expression from the target file which is located into a conf directory. Raw underscore JSON variable gets the content of the target file and each line is matched against the regular expression. If it is matched, it generates the payload into into the variable payload underscore event. The generated payload is passed to the function send log to analytics. The send log to analytics function is used to stream the logs to the helix log analytics using the post method which uses a bearer token and valid JSON body which was generated into the read log file function. Before running the script, let me show you the log entries from the log. Here you can see the log entries. Let's run the script. By test fetch the log .py. The output of the script will look for the string that matches into the log file and if the request is successful with the status code 200. In the message part, you can see the constraints, constraint error. The status code is 200. To verify the log entries into the BMC Helix log analytics, navigate to the discover from the left navigation. You will see the same constraint that we saw into the true site.log. This concludes my video. Thank you for watching.